Is it really necessary to pre-clear your sample prior to immunoprecipitation? Let's say you have taken the assumption that some proteins will always bind non-specifically to your solid phase. In order to remove these proteins, you need to pre-clear the sample, right? You take your sample and you incubate with the solid phase but without the antibody. And then you remove the solid phase and hope that this will take out all the proteins that will non-specifically bind with it and that would otherwise give rise to a certain background. You now repeat the process, only this time you include the antibody that specifically binds to your protein. If you use Dynabees, you can avoid background without any pre-clearing. As we have shown in Myth 1, you can go in directly with your magnetic bead coupled with your antibody to directly target your protein. It's like finding the needle in the haystack without having to remove 95% of the hay first. Of course, no pre-clearing means you have a shorter protocol, and because you are using half the amount of solid phase, it also means your experiment is cheaper. Have a look at Myth 4 to see how the myth about cost is busted. No wonder so many people are moving away from slurry and over to magnetic beads.